I'm starting to think there might not be anybody home. Hello? Maybe somebody's like watching me from afar. Like I, I, I'm here as an ally, a survivor. I, did, I know I came rolling in here looking like some kind of hobo Spartan, but trust me, I'm friendly. Not friendly to you, however. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Just because a rat is the size of a golden retriever doesn't mean it has the same temperament. What's up, guys? Welcome back to Raft, where for some mysterious reason, the entire planet is now an ocean. And for the last, uh, 125 days, Jesus Christ. I have been slowly going insane on my pile of floating garbage. And that's not to downplay the accomplishments. No, I have managed to build a bunch of engines out of scrap metal, and uh, a home out of scrap wood, and even planters out of scrap shoes. Now, I know some of you guys are probably thinking that filling a pair of Converse with dirt isn't exactly the most impressive survival skill, but uh, how about you try growing potatoes at sea? Now, some of you guys may remember that when we last left off, we had found this massive, disappointing bubble city. Like, it was really cool, but it had way too few survivors and way too many murder bots. And, like, the only thing that we walked away with, other than, you know, taser burnt butt cheeks, was uh, a code and a name. Varuna Point. I'm hoping if we put those numbers into our mayonnaise-powered, uh, Pringles-can-controlled, microwave-oven radar, then that should give us some kind of hit, I, I guess? A, a location? A, a vacation destination? Oh, beggars can't be choosers at this point. Yeah. Okay, so there's something that's... About two kilometers away in that area, ish. Uh, set a destination, Scary Terry. No. All right then. I, I guess I'll just do it myself. You man the radar, and I'll, I'll set the destination. I swear. <laughs> that guy, man, he drives me nuts. I don't know why I chose him to be my first mate. He's so belligerent, disobedient. I, I tell him all hands on deck, and he just stares at me. As if birds don't have hands, especially decapitated ones. <laughs> you know what? In retrospect, maybe I shouldn't be drinking so much salt water. Well, between that and the sun, my brain must look like somebody blowtorched a raisin. Oh, well, the engines work. That's good. Now we just need to kind of go over this way. Oh, who doesn't love navigating in the dark? Did I say the engines are working? I, I meant they're working for now, which lasted, uh, uh, well, about 20 seconds. <laughs> We're still within spitting distance of the bubble. I, I guess I just don't have enough fuel in them, maybe? Plenty of garbage in the ocean for us to burn off. Let's see if we place some planks. Okay, there we go. And if we run out of planks, I could always burn the llama. The, the chicken, I'm not above it. <laughs> They're gonna eat me out of house and home, I swear. It's really hard to grow grass on the ocean. As you can probably tell, I got sprinkler systems. I got everything. The lovely home that I've made for you. And you, you don't appreciate any of it. That being said, I'll be taking that. Oh, come on. Could you maybe not for like two seconds? I'm just trying to get to where I'm going. Small islands aren't all that impressive. I don't think there's anything there for us, except for maybe you know, wood that we could burn, but uh, I'm doing all right. I'm catching a whole bunch of floating garbage. Plastic burns just as well. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, hold on. Oh, we're, this is fine. This, this is... If I wasn't burning all of the wood, trust me, I would put up rails, but... We, we need fuel, Jesus Christ. It's a good thing I landed in the ocean. No one will know I pooped myself. Well, this is interesting. Uh, I'm sorting through my inventory trying to figure out what I should and shouldn't burn, and I found an electric purifier, which I don't remember making. It probably shouldn't burn it, but I, I suppose I could hook it up somewhere. 
What exactly do you purify? Is it water? Because that would be pretty dope. Uh, can't place it for some reason. What are you missing? It's just like a vacuum and a giant jug. Oh, it probably goes over the edge. Oh, I don't like placing stuff on the edge. That's shark territory. Uh, I don't really have a choice, do I? All right, electric purifier. And let me guess, you, you probably need a mayonnaise battery. I'm a little short on those right now. I got plenty of water, I'm doing fine. I think we might be just a little off course. This is what happens when you leave navigation to the bird head. How does that look? Hopefully we won't run into that island and we're back on course, perfect. Again, I'm not all that interested in random islands. I, I don't really have any use for them, but I did notice I've got other stuff in my inventory. Tangaroa painting. Oh, I stole this. Right. <laughs> this was in the city. Can I put it? Oh, somewhere? Maybe uh, here? Oh, yeah. Listen, you know, when you gotta bust a nut on the ocean, you've only got so many options. <laughs> Sometimes that's just gonna have to do. What else have we got? Uh, another Tangaroa painting. That one's gonna go right here. That one's not nearly as interesting, just pointing at the woman, I suppose. We've also got a decoration package. I, okay, package. Yeah, we'll uh, open you. I got a rug. Okay. Why do I choose to interior decorate at a time like this? We are so far up on the land. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. Okay, beautiful. Just gonna get around this minor obstacle. Everything is fine. I wanted to place my rug, but I, I think I just learned the ability to make a rug, but I I'm not seeing it here. I am seeing a bunch of new stuff though. We can make a recycler, a juicer, a drinking glass, engine controls. That seems quite a bit more important than some of this other stuff. A water tank, an advanced collection net. Ooh, okay, we're gonna learn all of this and I'm probably gonna start building stuff eventually. Not right now because I would imagine we're getting pretty freaking close to our destination. Uh, okay. Stuff's jumping around a little bit. Do you guys see that? I'm starting to think that this radar may not be entirely accurate. Go figure, right? 860 some odd meters. I don't think we're doing that bad. Fuel is definitely a little bit concerning because if one engine goes, then we don't move. We need all four of them at the same time. I'm, I'm lugging this small house behind me. This thing isn't making any fuel because I don't have bees. That's a reason to stop at an island. If we can get bees, they can make honey, we can use that. But right now I just wanna... When did this get up here? <laughs> I don't remember putting a piano on my roof. Did the birds bring me this? Can I... Huh. Oh, oh I can actually play? Hold on now. Uh... Nope, that's not it. Uh. Maybe I'll just stick to the whole keeping an eye out thing. I just want to higher ground. Even if I do have plenty of drinking water, I am gonna have to eventually invest some time in making this more of a water producer and less of a uh, paperweight. Uh, 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 first mate, could we maybe uh, get a destination check? Oh, that is probably what we're looking for. Can't think of too many cranes in the middle of the ocean that wouldn't interest me. Okay, we're, we're nice and, and, and drunk, drank, drinked, and then we're heading over here-ish. Okay, when the world starts to lag, that's usually a good thing. It means there's stuff appearing. What kind of stuff though? Okay, hold on, let's not jump off the edge. Is it an oil refinery? I don't think so, right? Because it, it's mostly just a crane. It's just a crane. Look, how did I go from entire bubble civilization to New York downtown? It doesn't make any sense. This sucks. There had better be somebody here. I'm just gonna throw it out there right now. The only thing I care about finding are survivors, civilization, people, just one person. And at this point, 
I'm a chick, right? I don't even care if it's a dude, a chick. I don't need to repopulate. I'll become a scissor sister if need be. We're so freaking close. Please don't fail me now. Actually, come to think of all the things that could go wrong, where's Barbara? I mean, I, I know I have her head mounted here, but her kids and grandkids and grand-grandkids always seem to show up at, like, the worst possible time. Which would be, like, right about now. That's why I'm holding this, ready to fend her off, but I guess not. What the hell is this? It's like somebody was just trying to build a mansion at sea. <laughs> Looks like a really big house. Uh, could we maybe get a little bit closer? Closer? I don't see anywhere to park or dock, as you can tell. I'm, I'm very much with the whole ship lingo. There's got to be somewhere for us to get in here. Or something for us to do. It just looks like a giant shell, right? Like it, it's not finished being built, clearly. Hello? Is there anybody here? I, I swear, if the only thing I find here are more golden retriever-sized rats, I'm, I'm just gonna drown myself. <laughs> Pull myself out of the misery already. Ooh, uh, getting a little close. Okay, and, uh, drive right into it. Yep, just straight into it. Ram the engine and the front of the boat right up against stuff. That's, that's exactly what I want, I swear. Just drop the anchor, who cares? We ran out of gas. <laughs> Talk about timing, holy crap. Okay, uh, just gonna turn all these off anyway and try to make that jump, I suppose. Do I wanna go in there at night? Not really. I think the best course of action is just to barbecue up a couple of rat steaks. Yes, that is rat, to give you an idea of how big they are. <laughs> While that's cooking, we can go to sleep. Do you maybe not watch? Just just one time? It's freaky. I'm like 95% sure that the second I get off this raft, Scary Terry is gonna take control. And I don't want you guys to listen to him, okay? While I'm gone, Cluckles is in charge. She's the only one that's actually providing anything around here. Now, where are my rat steaks? There we go, that's the good stuff. I might actually need to eat one of them right now. Or both of them right now. Hope that I don't die of some kind of disease, like drowning, oh, or shark eating. Oh, no, no, no. How, how do I get in? Why is this all rebarred up? Oh, I gotta move the friggin' boat closer. Or not. We're good. We are good. I don't know why I panic, and I don't know where Barbara is. If anything, it's freaking me out. If I find her in here, I swear to Christ. I'm starting to think there might not be anybody home. Hello? Maybe somebody's like watching me from afar? Like, I, I, I'm here as an ally, a survivor. I, I know I came rolling in here looking like some kind of hobo Spartan, but trust me, I'm friendly. Not friendly to you, however. I've said it before, and I'll say it again. Just because a rat is the size of a golden retriever doesn't mean it has the same temperament. Bite me once, shame on you. Bite me twice, and I think I can turn you into steaks. Hold on now, can I, uh, just, uh, come, come on, yeah, pick, pick up? There we go. That is gonna be dinner. I, I'm still cool, unless you're a giant rat. This might be promising, or not. 126 days on the ocean, I have forgotten how to open a door. Fair enough. Oh, I think if I want to get over there, I got to get up there. That looks like the kind of thing I could zip line down. Fair enough, so how do we climb exactly? Pile of garbage? Okay, yeah, here we go, a little hardcore parkour. And that's about the end of the journey. I'm, I'm two feet closer to my destination, but uh, that, that doesn't really count. That's the optimist in me talking. I'm so confused. Oh, I'm picking up what you're putting down. Okay, a little something like this. Okay, much better. Now we're getting somewhere. No, I can't fit that on my raft. I don't even think about it. Completely waste of time. We're just gonna do a little more like this. See, here's the thing. If I fall and, and break a leg, then uh, I'm telling you right now, 
Nobody's coming for me, especially not Scary Terry. Please tell me I packed enough arrows for this. Hey, guy. You don't want to jump to your death? No? Well, I do! I'm okay. Hello there. A man talking to dolls arrived yesterday. I found his loud discussions entertaining. Maybe I miss company a bit too. The man climbed high up into the crane with a satellite dish. He called out on his little radio for Astrid. It looked uh, unsuccessful. I might have stolen one of his dolls. Miranda is her name. The man left an hour ago after freaking out all day over it. <laughs> so many strange people these days. Interesting. So, not only have there definitely been people here recently who were trying to make the climb that I'm making, but there's this voice acting now. I really like that. <laughs> Hopefully, I can find more of those. God damn it. Why don't I just do this? There we go. That's the good stuff. Where did my rat steaks go? They decomposed already? Are you kidding me? Uh, uh, that doesn't look promising. I'm guessing here... See, this is the thing. I, I'm, I'm not meant for hardcore parkour, you know? Like, I, I'm meant for slowly meandering around on a raft. So when they add something like this to my adventure, it, oh, it's a real butt puckerer. I swear I could whistle right now. Just careful. I hate this. Are you kidding me right now? What kind of bird lives in... No. No, this is a scary Terry Central. I'm gonna run into all of his all of his relatives who who can't yeah. What what oh okay calm 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 down calm your birds. I thought you were a bird. There's no way you made those nests, right? C can I not hello? Hello, I would like your steakums. Thank you. Oh, that's concerning. Oh, that's why it sounds like my feet are made of flubber. Just listen to this. It's because I got freaking flippers on. So if I take those off and I put on boots and uh, maybe a helmet and armor. I didn't build armor. Probably should have built armor. Nope. Still got the wet flippy floppies. All right. Well, screw me, I suppose. Ooh, don't get attacked by a bird. What is that on the left? Oh, it's just cloth. I, th I thought it was like something, you know, chicken walking around. <laughs> no, we're good. Okay. So, yeah, we definitely want to go down there, right? Yeah, that's a zip line. Okay, but is there anything else? Can I get in here? I can get in here. Weird. I might be able to control that. Can I go further up, I wonder? Oh, I can. Okay, let's let's go up before we go down. Because I get the feeling as soon as I go down, getting back up is going to be a whole lot harder. Yeah, we're not going that way. What do we got over here? A tray? I could use a tray. Why can't I take stuff like this? <laughs> Tools? That'd be great. This is a uh, coconut chicken. Something tells me I shouldn't be eating coconut chick- Oh, somebody had a great little setup here. <laughs> this is probably a long time ago, though, so it's a little bit concerning. I would love to have a lazy boy back on my raft. This is what they were talking about in the letter, right? A uh, blueprint for an electrical grid? Interesting. Uh, okay, what do you have to say? When people come by, they don't stay for long. Why? Probably because I keep stealing their stuff. Today, it was a man named Ruben and a boy named Detto. They were caught in a storm and needed supplies. When they fell asleep, I nicked a whole set of tools. <laughs> Crude stuff, but still good. In the morning, they were so freaked out, they sailed away immediately. <laughs> Hilarious. I swear to God, if I go down to my raft and some kind of sea hobo has taken my stuff, I'm, I'm gonna... <laughs> Rip him a new one. Can I not use this? I, I kind of figured that was like the, the point of coming all the way over here, but uh, evidently not. 
part of me wants to jump and just land in the water next to my raft, but I, I know I should probably try to take the zip line. There could be something over on that other like section. Ooh, ooh. How do you go down? How, 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 what's down? Okay, down is forward, down, down is back, down is forward and back. Ladders, man, they're complicated. Okay, uh, good. Now we need to go down. It's starting to get dark. Hold on a second. Take off my helmet, put on... Uh, okay, well, I think I pissed away a lot of my battery, but hopefully we'll be able to do something. Okay, what does this do? Wait, wait, wait. Crane key? I don't have a crane key! I need a crane key! Where... What the freaking hobo keep his keys? <laughs> Down there, maybe? Oh, this sucks. This... Oh, this sucks! <sighs> Made it. Why do I feel like this is like a rat arena? I had to fight somebody to the death here. I can't do anything with this, and I'm not seeing anybody's keys lying around, so I'm kind of at a loss here. What did I miss? Did, maybe there was something in one of those notes? but they were already read out loud for me. He loves to go to people's ships and steal their stuff. Is he just back at my ship? You guys haven't seen like a vaguely European sea hobo around, have you? Like, anybody show up here when I was gone? Everything seems more or less here. I don't get it. Maybe I can craft a key somehow? Or was I supposed to find a key elsewhere? Oh, I found... Oh, it's electric grill, not electric grid. That is far less useful. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. So there's something underneath all of this. I gotta go find somebody's keys at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> what do you mean? I don't even know if I have anything for that. I technically have a bottle for oxygen and some flippers is that good enough i don't think that's gonna be good you know what screw it we'll just give it a try <laughs> what's the worst that could happen that's kind of cool oh the motion light okay you guys get out of the way i just swim on past hello there laguna point has all too many holes in it it makes it easy to move unnoticed Today, I nicked a hammer. Yesterday, I took some dried meat from the foreman's stash. It's less fun taking food, since it spoils eventually. The watch I got from the loudmouth driller was way more exciting. Uh, I want to grab something even better tonight. Okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> quiet panic there. They move back and forth. The light isn't motion, it's just a piece of crap and flickering. There's more of them. Oh, there's a bunch more of them. What was that? What was, what was all the shaking? Should I be concerned about the shaking? Okay, uh, got a buoy here. Is this air? Oh, this is air. Oh, that's very useful. Okay, good to know. This is super cool. Okay, so we can just kind of come up here. That's great. I don't need to worry too much about my oxygen bottle. But I do need to take a look around and see... Okay. Okay. No, it doesn't like me. It hates me. I wish I had armor. Why didn't I put on armor? Oh. It's dead. And I'm not. Can I... Ooh. I got an angerfish head and raw meat. More steakums. Wonderful. Anybody else in here want to die? Got more items? No more notes? What is this? Planks. Where were you a little while ago? How's my- oh, oh, there's oxygens at the top, I see. Okay, we, uh, might want to- What was that? Is this thing just falling apart? Is that what's happening right now? I think I'm okay. <laughs> I, I need to calm down. Door number two had a underwater pooper in it. Not particularly useful. Okay, door number three has... A spotlight part. Interesting. I do not have a spotlight. Could always use one, I suppose. 
I keep thinking I could pick up every little thing, but evidently not. I probably can't check through any of these. No, okay, stuff outside. All right, I think that's it for these doors. Air, please, air, please. Ew. It's just, yeah, it's gotta be that there's like parts falling off or something like that. I keep thinking it's gonna be like a giant shark shaking the place, like it's caged up down there. But I just assume the worst. Oh, is this an elevator shaft? This is an elevator shaft, so can we drop the elevator? Possibly. Might need to look around, see if there's something over this way. Fish! Dangerous fish! Not dangerous fish. Can I breathe you? I can breathe you. Okay. Well, we're making a whole lot of progress down here, and yet not really finding anything. <laughs> uh, except for paint. Can I shoot? I can. It kind of sucks, but it's better than nothing. Oh, okay, okay, oh, he's real pissed, he's real pissy. Who's the king of the ocean now, you venom wannabe? You better believe I'm gonna eat your face. There we go. Anything, oh, another spotlight part. I, I didn't come all this way for a spotlight, and I don't think I'm gonna find the survivor down here watching Survivor. So I'm really curious as to what all this is about. Other than the key, I suppose the key is just kind of the, the end goal. If I can move the crane, then what? I don't even know why I'm trying to move the crane. I'm just moving it for the sake of moving it. So we've cleared section G. Good to know. Now, I have had enough deep sea shenanigans for one video, my friends. If you could all move your stingy selves before I piss on you. Nobody, very few like that. But I'm pretty sure jellyfish are uh, ones who definitely don't. Okay, now I, I gotta clear out my inventory, I, I, I gotta eat, drink, so on and so forth. I think this is gonna be a whole lot to explore. I might need to save this for later. You know what, I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Raft, guys. I think I've been playing this game for close to four years now, and it's crazy to think that this is the final chapter. This is it, the full game is released. So assuming that this is the final destination, we should figure out what happened to the world. Why is it all ocean? Are there any other survivors? All of the questions that have been building for years should hopefully be answered next episode. If you guys want to see more, you know, as always, be sure to leave a like in the video, leave a comment letting me know, and maybe I'll return for more deep sea discoveries. But thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.